Hi there, my name is Nick van der Berg. I'm a solutions architect for Poly and covering everything on Zoom. And today I'm going to show you a workspace reservation demonstration. Uh, that is a functionality which is currently in beta by Zoom. Uh, and it could be enabled on any uh, Zoom Rooms device. So it's a, a Poly Studio X device or a G7500. I'm going to show it today on the Studio X30, uh, which I have set up. And I will continue into the demonstration part right now. What if you have got uh, certain devices which can work as a virtual receptionist? So what I will do is I will show, uh, this is a Studio X30, but it works on every Studio X device, any collaboration device we have, or the G7500 as an integrated solution. You will see this is a, a Studio X30 in a kiosk mode, as we call it, a Zoom, a Zoom kiosk mode. Uh, you will see right away here, it's got a large button, call a receptionist, maybe to check into the office, um, but also a workspace reserve your desk or room uh, button. So what I will do, and uh, well, I'm doing a little bit of uh, funky things here because I'm, I'm just alone here. Uh, and I've got this set up to call a receptionist, but the receptionist is actually this iPhone here. So what I will do is I'll press the button, call a receptionist right here. And you'll see my Zoom client ringing over here. I will accept it for a second. I will immediately leave that call right away. But imagine that you have just checked into, uh, into that building. So they, can, uh, they know you are actually there and they can, uh, can say to you, uh, please reserve your desk or maybe a conference room using that button right there. Uh, I will zoom in a little bit more right here. So we're going to show that workspace reservation. This is currently in beta from Zoom, but we have got it running to just show it because it is that innovation and the returning to work um, is, is of critical uh, importance there. So when you press the workspaces button, you will see you can load up a floor plan of your typical enterprise. This is our uh, typical enterprise right here. And immediately what I can do is I can either uh, search for a desk where I want to sit for that day. But I can also show that uh, those meeting rooms, those, that, is, uh, that is green right now. So let's book that meeting room. Um, what you will see here on the side is uh, actually at, at six o'clock, it is already busy and I want to do a two hour meeting there. So let's bring it to the eight, uh, eight to 10. Uh, it's going to be a late day today, but uh, I will press that next button and reserve that meeting. Won't do that right now because, uh, well, we're in a webinar right now, so well, it's not that nice to book that meeting right now. Um, then I will want to make sure I can work my time until that meeting in the office. So I want to get to that focus desk right here uh, and book that time from now until eight when I've got the meeting. What I will do next is I just use my Zoom client on my phone um, using the scan QR code and I just scan that QR code to reserve my desk right there. It's as easy as that. And what, what comes up when you go to your desk, and I will move over a little bit here. So you will see on my desk where I just reserved, you will see that uh, I can, uh, this desk is available for now, and I can just scan that QR code. Again, I'm using that Zoom application on my iPhone um, with that universal user interface, as you see on all the devices scan the QR code again. And this is my personal Zoom client. I can have that check-in button right here. And when I press that, you will see this Zoom phone, this desk phone will have all of my meetings, my own meetings, my personal uh, uh, Zoom client right there on this device. Maybe press it a little bit more so you can see. So in here, I can just join my meetings, which are in my calendar. I can call people using an extension uh, I can see my history of calls, uh, calls people, uh, but I can also browse my contact list. And when I'm done, because I need to go to my conference room, I just check out and somebody else can book that room again. And this was it for now. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the demonstration. And if you want to learn more about how to use workspace reservation, uh, you can visit that on the Zoom web portal and you can find the URL here below. Thank you. Bye bye.